the periodic table, noble gas is stable. Good morning, Lake Nona, and welcome back to Herpetology Month with Science Spotlight. My name is Gabby Irons, and today is going to be all about vipers and venom extraction. Vipers are a large family of snakes found almost all over the world. All vipers are venomous and have long, hinged fangs. They all have a speedy strike and are typically nocturnal. The most known types of vipers are rattlesnakes, and if you didn't know, rattlesnakes are best known for, well, their rattle. These rattles are composed of keratin segments, meaning they're actually completely empty. The buzzing sound comes from these segments knocking against each other. Rattlesnakes are found in the southern parts of the United States, from the deserts to the mountains, and grow between three and four feet long. Rattlesnakes feed on rodents, squirrels, rabbits, and other small critters. They hibernate through the winter and come out in the spring to eat and then mate. Babies are born venomous but cannot rattle and are often more aggressive than the adults. Many vipers are used for venom extraction. The Serpentarium does milking shows twice a day where George and Rosa Van Horn extract venom from their snakes. Then they ship the venom to facilities that will use it to produce antivenom. The antivenom is created by injecting venom into a domesticated animal such as a horse and extracting the antibodies that the animal creates. Thanks for tuning in to today's episode of Science Spotlight. If you'd like to see more about vipers, visit our YouTube channel and as always, stay nerdy, Lake Nona.